You too. What's going on again, man? It's your boy, The Smurf Life. Coming in, checking in with another little video for y'all, man. On this nice little Tuesday, Wednesday. I don't even know what day it is. Well, yeah, man, that's... I'm just cooling right now, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, But right now, man, I want to show y'all this little upgrade I'm trying to do, man. A little mod on the little grabber right here. This my boy, the grabber right here. 03 Audi A6 Quattro. 50 50. You know what I'm saying? What we taking, what we doing right now is you see all of this chrome. This chrome don't even shine no more on the car. You know what I'm saying? At least the, the chrome on the back don't shine no more. You know what I'm saying? I got chrome all the way around, like my window pillars and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So, what I did today was I actually I, I started. I started. Don't tell nobody nothing. YouTube. I started. Started late. But, uh, the first little thing I did, man, not even really the first thing, but one of the things that I've done, you know what I mean, is uh, I took my grill out the car, man. Took the grill out the car. Say so the grill, the main grill, should I say, out of the car, because you know I got the lower grill too. Shout out to Audi. But uh, I took the grill out the car, man. It was looking real ashy. If y'all can look and see, you know what I'm saying? It looked kind of ashy down there. You know, don't, don't, that's the ground right there. Don't pay no attention to that. We talking about this here. That black needs some lotion. You know what I'm talking about? That black needs some lotion. So what we did, man, was I went on over to the lotion store. You know what I'm talking about? And I resprayed the grill. I resprayed the grill. That grill don't look like 2003 to me. Hey, man, don't be paying no attention to the chip in my grill neither, man. You know what I'm saying? It ain't my teeth. But yeah, man. We spray that boy, put it, put it back to stop black. On tomorrow. Shout out to Wu Tang. <laughs> but yeah, man. Uh, just spray that back real quick. But then I came up with another little idea. I said, well, I got the matte black in the grill. You know what I'm saying? What can I do to make it funky? Cause you know what I'm saying. Everybody got the look. Got the, the the chrome ring. So I say, let me go back over here with the gloss black. You know what I mean? And we gonna throw the grill in the game like this. You see what I'm saying? I just got finished spraying this too. I hope it's dry, which it probably ain't. But this is what we looking for. This is what we in the business for right there. Ooh! Lord! Have mercy! Look at this. Look what just happened. Holy moly donut shop. Boy, that's so far right there. Yeah. On that 03 thing though. On that 03 thing though. Yeah. Yeah, man. That's exactly what we were looking for. So we're gonna go ahead on and let him sit right there and dry. But that's exactly what we was looking for. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, let you take a nice look at that thing. And then we got the black chrome housing to go back around there. So when we poke them back in the grill, that's gonna give it a whole nother vibe. Boy! Yeah, this is what we doing. You know what I'm saying? And not to mention, man, I got a lot of plans for this thing. You know what I'm saying? We gonna, uh, we gonna take the, the windshield wipers off this thing. And we gonna, uh, paint them back black just make sure everything on this thing is supposed to be black is back to black you know what i'm saying be it gloss black or you know what i'm saying flat black matte black i'm just gonna make sure that the try to make sure that the car look even better they talking about 500 dollars just to tent the boy but i got old tin i gotta take off and old glue stuck on my arm uh, on my joint from when i first got the car so uh i had it a little bit over a year now you know what i'm saying she down right now Cause I think the alternator, the alternator just went out. You know what I'm saying? But pff, get that tomorrow. Get that fixed tomorrow. But uh, yeah, just a little short video, man, to show y'all I'm out here active, doing my thing. I think I'm gonna go ahead on and pop these housings off real quick to these uh to my fog lights, and then I'll be able to spray them up while I'm in that you know in a spraying mood, if you will. But uh, yeah, YouTube. Yeah.
Comment down below, man. Tell me what you think it might look like if, it, if it's hot or not. You know what I mean? And uh, oh, get down here, man, and see what we can get into. I'm going to get right back with y'all in a few seconds, man. Let y'all see what's going on on YouTube. We right back at you, like I said. Give me just half a second. And we got the lower grill out now. And the, and the uh, chrome housing also. Got them boys sitting over here cleaned up, getting ready to get sprayed down with the matte black and the uh, gloss black. So we can have a complete looking grill. And I'm going to look to see if I can, if I got the right tools to be able to remove the housing for the uh, fog lights also, which are fully functional by the way, considering the age of the car. But yeah, we gotta get these, these housings out of here real quick. So uh, once we get those housings out, then we'll be actually completely prepared to spray the car. From this point, from that point, then I'll be taping off the headlights and taping the bumper off, exposing nothing but that chrome line right there. We'll be hitting that chrome line with the, uh, we'll be hitting that chrome line with the paint. We'll be doing the same thing with the border around the window, both of them. The door ain't closed all the way. But yeah, we'll be doing the same thing with the chrome here, the chrome border on the trunk. If we can't even remove it, to get it done right. But all of this chrome molding is coming off of the car to be spray painted gloss black. Yeah. And it might even be these boys too. Get them boys up off of there and spray paint that gloss black too. Get this up out of there. And respray this. That's easy. That's an easy little removal right there. To get that up out of there. But we're gonna respray that. We're gonna respray this. You know what I mean? We're gonna shine these mighty rings back up. You know what I'm saying? We got the top of the line motor for this boy too. So y'all know. And it's a little cute little package over there for you too. You understand? That arrow means something. You better pay attention. The arrow means something. You know what I'm saying? But that's the top of the line motor for this Quattro right here, guys. You know what I'm saying? Outside of the RS6, that's the monster right there, buddy. That's the monster right there. That's the motor everybody here in Alabama respect. Especially them pickup trucks that them boys believe in so much. You understand me? Odd place for your battery. Odd place for your battery. You know what I'm saying? Nice little cool spot for it, though. You know, I had to get the oversized thing. You know what I'm saying? Cause we finna put some music in this thing too. Yeah, something to the tune of two tens, 112 with eights in the rear doors. Yeah, we're gonna have us a little sound house here. But yeah, man. Also, I wanted to take the time too to shout out the boys, man. You know what I'm saying? But we gonna start off the right way though. You know what I'm saying? Shout out first, man. First and foremost, the uh, DJ Ron, the mechanic, man. Hey, boy, I see you out there. That dad going to Nissan starting to look better and better. All that dad going to carbon flop on that thing look the most, bro. You're doing your thing, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about you go out there to the parking lot. You're going to know which car yours. You're going to definitely know which car yours. So, yeah, man, that's what we're doing right now, guys. Getting right back to it on this dad going uh on this Audi, man, A6. Uh, I got a couple of fairings back here, too, man. A couple of motorcycle fairings that I painted for my brother-in-law. You know what I mean? So, just let it be known, man. I gets down with them cans. You get it? I gets down with them cans. You understand me? I'm just waiting on my airbrush kit to come in now so I can finish this up. And then he'll be up here later this summer for me to do his gas tank in his front fairing. You know, the gas tank, the main attraction on them bikes. You know what I mean? But yeah, this is what we're doing today, though. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can see the difference, for real. Because the lower grill is right here and the upper grill has been painted already. Y'all can definitely see the difference. You know what I'm saying? And that's exactly, that's that's really the point of me doing it, man, was to try to just, to, you know, brand new it a little bit, make it look a little bit more presentable. The car is old. You know what I'm saying? We headed into 2023. 
So it's about to be a classic. I mean, I might, I got to keep it. Cause once it got, once it become a classic, it's right there with the two Jay Z's. I mean, I'm sorry, this ain't the RS motor, but that boy got some kick to it. You understand me? I get right where I need to be every time. You feel me? You figure deal me? Find, I, I might just find some heat resistant paint too. You know what I mean? So I can uh get my muffler tips and uh you know spray my muffler tips black too. For real. Just to keep everything concurrent. You know what I'm saying? It already got plenty of carbon in there already. So I figure like, you know what I'm saying, we hit them boys too. And this lower molding right here too looking all gray. <laughs> I can tell you back in Tucson where this car was born at, it was definitely not great. You know what I mean? We got big plans for the rap status on this boy. For real, big plans. So y'all just stay tuned, man. See what we got going. You see we got dents and body corrections and stuff we got to do. We got paint corrections on the top we got to do. So it's a lot of content, guys. Just stay tuned, because I'm going to stay steady. You understand me? Changing out the hood. Just so y'all know, we changing out these fenders too. I'm keeping it, I'm keeping the marker light, but we changing out these fenders. I done found some nice stuff for this car. You know what I'm saying? So just let it be known, man. This thing is not gonna look like this. And I guarantee you, and I'm gonna put my face on the camera when I say this, I guarantee you, when I get done with this boy, it's gonna be 32 game, stunt squizzy approved. Bet on it, cause I'm a fool with these colors. You understand? Hey, man, this your boy, The Smurf, man. Check it out. I'm going to get with y'all again.